Okay, welcome back to some more Mori. I remember what I'm doing, promise. I didn't have to look at the keyboard to try and work out what buttons I have to click. Hey look, I was right, another one. Okay, cat is. That's the wrong, that's the wrong thing. I didn't want to be on that. Who's wearing cat is? Who's about to look friggin' adorable? Plus one defense, plus ten speed. I know exactly who uses speed. <laughs> I kind of wish they drew cat ears on him. That would be adorable. That would be my new favorite thing. A floating mirror. Your friends smile warmly behind you. Very cute. Definitely going to turn somehow sinister at some point, though. Got it. Ooh, there's a melon as well. Okay, so I'm going to have to go over and... Tomato. That wasn't really worth it. I didn't see any other melons or anything over there. Okay, let's go. Yes. There's a bear. Can't say hello to a bear yet. Hello. It's right here. We got this. is vicious. Was that enough? Was that enough? Hey! By the end of this, Hero is gonna... <laughs> Hero is never gonna be afraid of any insect again, just because how many he's murdered. Present. Oh, I remember what that does. It inflicts sadness. <laughs> Hi. I wasn't expecting you to do that, but okay. Nope, didn't mean for you to do that. Oh. Okay. Continue. Wait, don't mark it. I need you to be sad on yourself. You... No, he needs more than bread. That should do. You need to cook for yourself right now. Okay. Yikes. You can't headbutt right now because you don't have the health for it. So tell you what. Jam. Ho ho ho. You're 
out of that. Attack normally. Headbutt. Skill. Just attack here, and you will cook for yourself. Ah, oh, that was a waste of life, Jam. I did it. <laughs> wow, that really didn't give me much, did it? Mush. Hi, hello, stranger. I am Mush, and my lifelong dream has been, has always been to be eaten and enjoyed. Will you finally? Yes. I'm a trip balls, aren't I, if I eat this? Where's Mush? Makes a friend slightly stronger. One heart, one juice, one attack, one defense, one speed, and one luck. Nice. Okay. You know what's even nicer, though? <laughs> Being able to heal after that really big ouch that we just went through. Tell you what, I'm actually gonna quickly head back and just have some more block of tofu. <laughs> Not a big fan of tofu, but <laughs> it's better than dying, I guess. Okay. Plants back. Not happy about it, but it's back. The bear is back. What the heck is this thing? It's kind of slimy and smells like bad apples. There's more forest on the other side of this lump. Ah, come on, Aubrey, smashed it. Oh, what's this? You're asking me for help, Kel? How rare. Step aside, I'll show you how it's done. I'm going to give this strange lump all I've got. She's not going to be able to, and we need the minecart. Well, this is embarrassing. I guess we should find another way past this thing. Yes, let's do that. You took that well. I'll give you that. I am not fighting you again. Just, just do it. It's okay, buddy. I need another track. Where can I find another track? Okay, that was a self-destruct attack. Cool. Not really cool, but more so painful, actually. Okay. Aha. Did look like I could go this way. Oh, no, no, no. I'm out. Bye. Gone. Nope. Good. That was creepy. Didn't like that. No, not a bit. I'm worried, I believe. There you go. Hero is afraid of spiders. 
Listen, we're just gonna pile onto it, I believe. piece of tofu and we'll try and deal with that cat hopefully avoiding that plant thing as well okay guys chomp on the tofu however I have realized something already this place seems like a pretty okay place to uh, uh grind if I need to because that bear right there he gave quite a bit of XP. Okay, let's go up here first. Oh, okay, never mind. Hello, cat. Goodbye, cat. anything that's happening right now. Where does this go? Okay, that other way heads towards a melon. Huh. Get the hell out of there. Okay, you're all okay. Also, we got a tail now. What does a tail do, Omori? Fifteen speed. Okay, I don't think anyone really needs like that ludicrous amount of speed. What do you have? Yeah. back to sleep you creepy cat monster speaking of creepy hi it's you the weird shadow monster that follows me around and haunts my dreams oh okay that's just a way to head back to get the metal stop that Stop. Shadow Basil, hello. A magical beam? What does a magical beam do? Where it starts off battle with a random emotion. Hmm. That could be kind of fun for Omori if I do the like happy slice one. Because then, because then the only thing that he wouldn't be like, okay, this is creepy. But yeah, the only thing he wouldn't really benefit from as much is the angry one. Hi. Mm. Remember how I said creepy? Mm. Yeah, now it's real creepy. Welcome to the Lost Forest, where you find things you never knew were lost in the first place. Or perhaps they're forgotten for a reason. Like you. Okay, so there's 
So this is the central place. This is a place I'll be coming back to quite a bit. That's unless ah no. Is there anything? Anything that gives this away? What I need to do? Ah. I suppose we all hold secrets. No matter how lost or how deep down we bury them. They find their way back to the other side. I don't know how I, I did that, honestly speaking. I kind of just... Okay, that, that quite clearly wasn't the right way. Up here? That rabbit creeps me out. Trying to lose yourself? Or have you accomplished that already? Either way, this is the right place for you. Perhaps that's why you've come here, to finish the job. What job? I don't know what you're talking about and I don't, don't want to find out, frankly. I think it keeps sending me back if I get it wrong. What if I go down? Okay, no, that does actually send me back. Where the hell am I? Okay, I'll talk to you. Usually we tend to do things we want, as opposed to, thing to things we say we do. I've never been one for wants. I'm more of a need kind of person. I suggest you look for an exit before your needs be become more apparent. I picked up a pearl. Is that an equipable? It is not. What's this way? Damn it. I've gone back. just gets creepier and creepier. You're still here. You must have either given up or you have fully embraced your fate. A confession perhaps, but I'm not the one to tell. But I'm not one to tell. Damn it, I've gone all the way back. Is this one seems to continuously be the one guarded by a rabbit so does that mean it's going to be down here this time there was a boy wandering around here before very similar to you he went into a darkness and never came out how regretful it must have been to never find what he was looking for be it regret defeat or confusion no one will know Okay, I'm going to follow where the bunnies go, are coming from, because that seems to be working fairly well. I've seen lost, I've seen blind, but the combination is unsettling. Perhaps you are hiding away from the right way. No, is that not the right way? Seems to be only one direction to go. Campfire? Please don't be a boss battle. You've reached the end of the long lost forest, but the beginning of the truth. I will tell you a story that has been lost through time. A story about creation of this reality. In the beginning there only existed two. The dreamer and his room. Omori and his room, okay. The dreamer grew weary of his room and created a door that led to many different worlds. Walking the path as a visitor to these worlds, the dreamer would go, come and go as he pleased. Slips and falls, tumbles and drops, the dreamer's curiosity and clumsy exploration eventually led him to a certain world. One not like the others, one painted with chaos and bathed in darkness. 
The dreamer slowly became filled with dread. Quiet as they may have been, words of malice quietly crept into his mind, whispering lies, secrets, and truths. Powerless to silence the noise, the dreamer manifested benevolent entities in his different worlds. Then he compounded his worlds above the dark realm, sealing it with their combined might. Yet despite his valiant efforts, the darkness present, darkness's present, mm, presence never abated. Even with new allies, the darkness continued to scrape and scratch at the back of the dreamer's mind. The noise might have been subsided, but it never went away. The dreamer could run, aw run away and bury his fears, but one still ha has to face his own reflection. What the dreamer had created was something he could not be a part of, something outside himself. The dreamer's own power was his greatest adversary, knowledge. What absence of it would become the dreamer's greatest gift. To truly escape the perils of his own faculty and ascend to a blissful state of ignorance, only then the noise would cease to agitate the dreamer's sanity. So, the dreamer took another name and chose to forget himself. And from that time on, the dreamer has lived among us simply as an inhabitant of this world, travelling along blissfully, ignorant of his own fabrication. Children, I must warn you, as with all things that are born in and out of this world, an end will threaten this one too, though the dreamer may have subdued the inexplor- the in inexorable- inexorable? Oh, the darkness grows still. No bandage can stifle an eternal wo wound, and there will be a time when its influence will bleed through. Forgetful the dreamer may be of this peril, a peril never forgets to be. Yet the end of the world may be inevitably, may be inev an inevitability. The dreamer is the only one with the ability to truly set this world free. Okay. Okay, that was creepy. I saw that. was kind of hoping for a rail. However, I have yet to find one. Perhaps if I head upwards. Go this way. Just run. Okay, this one I need to light. There we go. Okay, there was no rail. This is an issue. I am a wee bit lost. But I'm afraid that we'll have to wait until next time. If you enjoyed my content, please check out everything else I upload onto this channel. I upload a lot of different types of indie games, a lot of roguelites, admittedly. I am a big fan of roguelites. Until next time. Bye.